And now I bring you the album review of Koi Lure, Trendsetter. So this album is exactly what I thought it would be. An album that jumps from wave to wave attempting to find an audience by approaching all audiences. Which always ends up with you getting no audience because you aren't being yourself. You got your Afrobeat songs, you got your grime song, you got commercial styles. On top of more features than actual full length songs to help carry the load because she isn't prepared to do more than 2.5 minutes on average. These are all symptoms of someone that's not fully prepared for mainstream mass promoted project. But this is what the industry deliberately puts out because they can get over contractually on her easier than someone that's more experienced. But I'm not here to say that this album is terrible. There are some moments like Hollywood Dreams, the intro that I wish was more of the trendsetter of what this project ultimately could have become because it was quality project, no rides to wave here. It shows you the potential of what she could be, but yet it just leaves it at that.